Hello and welcome. Today we're talking about putting an end to cold market prospecting forever. So the reason why I want to talk to you about this today is because the way most people do prospecting and recruiting, creating your list of 100 people, going after friends and family, um, you know, ad tagging, messaging on social media, chatting up people, total strangers on social media is actually, believe it or not, dangerous to your health. Yes, and I'm going to explain exactly why that is. I'm Gloria McDonald, if you're new to me, and I mentor and train network marketers, affiliate marketers, and coaches on how to build, build your businesses and grow your teams using the two most powerful tools there are on the planet today, the power of your consciousness, your mind, your energy, and the power of the internet, and particularly LinkedIn. So, as you're hopping on here, let me know um, if you can hear me. Let me know where you're coming in from. I'd love to hear from you. There's a bit of a delay in uh, this whole new Facebook Live thing. So please forgive me if I don't see you right away. So <clears throat> I am going to share with you today a truly tried, tested, and true method for you to recruit prospect and recruit absolutely positively 100% rejection free. And let me know if that is something that you would be interested in. Would you like to do that? Now here's the deal. There's a secret to this and it's a very little known secret that most people are, are totally unaware of frankly and other people don't talk to it. And it's why you're not being as successful as you want to be, why you struggle to prospect, recruit, and get new business builders, and it is why your business builders aren't successful at duplicating the system. So let me just say hello to a couple of people here. Hey, Marky, and great to see you. Hello, Alice, good to see you. Hey, Anne from Nairobi, Kenya. Hello, Rob from Sacramento, California. Carmen, hello, 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 Amy. Um, Carlene from Ontario, right here close to me. Hello, Jim Packer from beautiful Wickenburg, Arizona. Hey, Tony Pratt. Hello, Carl Erickson. Hello, Martha Herda. Great to see you guys. Okay, so um, here's the thing. If you don't learn how to recruit rejection free, and if you don't teach your team members how to recruit rejection free, the chances of you being successful in this business are extremely, extremely, extremely thin and slim. Are there people who are successful in this business without uh, using these methods that I'm going to talk about? Yes, there are, and they are very few and far between, <clears throat> and they are at the top. But I want to help you get to the top. I want to help way, way, way more people be successful in this powerful industry of network marketing. So. Here's the deal. There's a scientific reason for why you haven't been as successful as you want to be yet. And it's not your fault. You see, it's the brain, your brain. Now, there's good news here today. The good news is you have a brain. But I have to tell you, the bad news is you've got a brain. And your brain is literally working against you virtually 100% of the time because your brain's primary job is to keep you safe. And rejection is not safe and failure is definitely not safe. So let's face it, when you write your list of 100 people, you go after friends and family members, you try to chat up people on social media that you don't know or even ones that you know from high school or whatever, there's a ton of rejection involved in that. And it just is not safe. So your brain is trying to take you out. Your brain doesn't like rejection. And because your brain is working overtime to keep you from experience rejection, what the brain does is it causes you to feel fear. Now, fear is a very natural thing. Fear is a physiological and biological mechanism to protect us from death. <laughs> and we don't want to die, right? So the amygdala, which is that oldest part of the brain that's in the back of the brain, um, sends a biological and neurological response through your body when you perceive fear, um, whether it's real or imagined. 
Now, I've never heard of anybody dying of network marketing rejection, but your brain doesn't know that. And when you're prospecting and recruiting the old school way, your brain is literally working against you. And your brain has three very natural responses to fear, which is caused by perceived possibility of rejection. One is freeze, two is fight, and three is flee. Now, our brains are amazing, amazing, amazing things. And listen to this. There are 400 billion bits of information coming through your five senses at any given moment. 400 billion bits of information. And there's a part of your brain that's always scanning things all the time, looking for things that are perceived to be unsafe. And when you feel the feeling of fear, you instinctively move away from danger. So think about it. Let's see all of a sudden you hear a loud noise. Your, your natural reaction is to flinch. Um, and that is your brain keeping you safe. And it's no different when your brain anticipates something that might cause you to feel uncomfortable, might feel, cause you to feel embarrassed or ashamed, like rejection then what your brain is going to do, it's going to naturally cause you to move away from that. So your brain is doing 10,000 trillion actions per second. Did you hear that? Your brain is doing 10,000 trillion actions per second, most of which is for the purpose of keeping you safe. So let's imagine this scenario, right? Um, you're at your kid's soccer game and one of the other moms, let's call her Beth, is on your list. She doesn't know anything about what you're up to with your network marketing opportunity, but you just know she'd be perfect. Oh my gosh, she'd be perfect in this business. And she's standing about 20 feet from you. And you haven't seen her in a couple of months, so you've got to figure out how to say hello and bring up your opportunity and you're desperately trying to figure out, okay, what am I gonna say to her? You know, yeah, I've gotta say hello, I've gotta connect. What, how am I gonna bring up this opportunity? And your mouth starts getting dry and your heart starts pounding and your palms start getting sweaty and you freeze. It's not your fault. It's not that you don't have a big enough why. It's not that you're a chicken. It's not that you need more training. It's just your brain causing a very natural physiological and biological reaction. That's all it is. It's your brain causing you to stop dead in your tracks. It's your brain doing its primary, <clears throat> excuse me, its primary duty to keep you safe. Okay, let's look at another situation. <clears throat> excuse me. Let's say you're at a family reunion and your cousin Joe is going to be there. And you've been thinking about your cousin Joe because you know that uh, you know Joe would be a rock star on your team. And you know you're going to approach him at your family reunion. <clears throat> so, you haven't seen Joe in a couple years. You go say hello to Joe and Joe says, hey, what on earth are you up to? And you think, oh, great. Thank you, Joe. Thank my lucky stars. You just opened the door for me to talk to you about my opportunity. And you start talking to Joe about your new network marketing opportunity. And Joe rolls his eyes and says, oh my gosh, don't tell me you're in one of those pyramid scheme things. And what do you, what happens next? The next thing you know it, <clears throat> you're arguing with Joe. You're justifying your decisions. You're defending yourself and it ends up not being a pretty picture at all. So the fight begins, right? Now, again, it's not your fault. It's just your brain. It's your brain doing its job, causing you to fight, defend yourself, justify your actions, and defend yourself about sudden death that's about to be caused by Joe rejecting you. <laughs> not really but that's what your brain thinks. This is the way your brain works. Okay, so let's take another scenario. Uh, maybe you've experienced this. Oh my gosh, you are so pumped. You're so pumped. You just found a new opportunity. 
You've been three, four, five others, but this one, this one is the one, this one, oh my gosh, the compensation plan is amazing. The product is absolutely groundbreaking. Your upline is incredible. She's got this all new Facebook strategy. Oh my gosh, this time, this time it's it. Yes, I know it, I know it. I am so pumped. So you start hitting up your friends on Facebook with that all new special fake phony friends strategy. And, or, or maybe, 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 maybe you've got a new hocus pocus. You're going to make millions with Facebook ad strategy that you're trying out. Yes. Either way, before you know it, ugh, the car, hard, cold facts of rejection and failure hits you smack in the face and you quit. Yep. You flee. Now, again, guys, it's not your fault. It is just your brain being, well, a brain. That's what your brain does to you. So it's not that you're a loser. It's not that you don't have a why that makes you cry. It's not that you're not as smart as the ones who made it. It's none of that. It's just that you've got to learn to work with your brain rather than against your brain. And you see all along, you have been working against your brain. And with the exception of a rare, rare, rare number of people, that is not going to work. And believe it or not, all the stress that's caused by the fear of rejection, the anxiety of, you know, old school belly to belly techniques, writing the list of a hundred, chatting up your friends and family, um, feeling like a failure because you're dumping more money down the drain of Facebook ads. All of that is actually causing your brain to pump dangerous chemicals of the hormones of stress into your body. And it is actually honestly harmful to your health, believe it or not. That's why prospecting is dangerous to your health, unless you know how to do it rejection free. Now you're saying, I can hear you saying this, but wait, what Gloria, can you really do rejection free recruiting? Can you really? And the answer is yes, absolutely. 100% you can. I'm doing it and my clients are doing it all day, every day. And my team members are doing it all day, every day. So if you want to dig deeper into this, I'm about to share with you my super simple three-step TTC methodology. But if you want to dig deeper into this, go to GloriaMcDonald.com slash discover L I that's GloriaMcDonald.com slash discover L I. Now, let me tell you about my super simple three-step TCC methodology. And this is how you start to recruit truly rejection free. Um, step one is target. The T stands for target. Step two stands for cultivate. The C stands for cultivate. And step three, the C stands to, for convert. And you do this using the incredible untapped gold mine of LinkedIn. So step one, you target people who have a proven interest in what you have to offer. And I had a multiple eight figure uh, mentor who used to always say what you want wants you. And he was right. The people that you're looking for are also looking for you. And when you know how to target those people and man, you can target people so powerfully on LinkedIn without paying a dime for advertising and without paying a dime for LinkedIn. You can highly target people who have a proven interest in what you have to offer. This is the first step in absolutely eliminating rejection. Step number two, you cultivate a relationship with those prospects. Now I am not talking about being fake social here. I'm not talking about chatting up people, messaging people, asking them how their day is going or how it's going for them in their business. When you honestly, honestly, honestly don't give a hoot how their day is going or how it's going for their going for them in their business, you're just trying to strike up a phony conversation for the purpose of getting them into your opportunity. Guys, that does not work. Please, 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 please don't do that. But instead be a leader. 
okay? And being a leader is providing real value. And re by real value, I mean giving people real tools, tips, great information that they can use, whether it's in building their network marketing business or really great tools, tips, and information on their health and wellness, on skincare, whatever it is. But be a leader, lead with real value. And then you start to build an email list and a text message list because people are going to provide you with their name and email address or their phone number when you provide them with something that they want of real value. So you start being a leader. You start building this email list. You start building your text messaging list. And this is truly zero rejection. Zero rejection. And just uh, people who are interested in what you have to offer are going to raise their hand and say yes. Only the people that are interested in what you have to offer are going to raise their hand and say yes. Yes, please send me that free guide. Yes, please send me those recipes. Yes, please send me those free tips. Only the people that are interested in what you have to offer. So this has zero rejection in it. And then step three, this is where you convert. So you convert those prospects into customers and team members. And when people have, when your prospects have raised their hands enough times saying, yes, I'm interested. Yes, I'm interested. Yes, I'm interested. Then you offer them something and maybe you offer your product. Maybe you offer your opportunity. Maybe you offer, uh, offer them uh, a free consultation call with you. You give them a link to your online calendar. And when you've provided enough value up front and you've provided enough great information and tools and tips, just like I'm doing here with you today, I'm providing truly valuable information that I know in my heart works. I know it works because I experience it myself and because my clients and my team members are experiencing it. So I, this is proven. This is absolutely a proven methodology. So, when you provide enough value up front, when you provide enough information up front, people start to know, like, and trust you. We've all heard that. We know that, that people buy and join people who they know, like, and trust. Okay, okay. But when you provide enough inf information and value up front, this is the key. Your prospect has already made a decision before they ever even hop on a call with you that they're interested in you and what you have to offer. Your prospect already knows they've already made a decision. And this changes everything. It absolutely positively changes everything. So before they ever book that call with you, they've already raised their hands a ton of time saying, yes, I'm interested. Yes, I'm interested. Then they book on their, on your calendar. And then you have a rejection free, conversation with that person. Now, it just so happens that in the past six weeks, I have recruited uh, 68 people personally into my network marketing opportunity. And just today, we hit 101 people on the team in six weeks. And this is, this is how it's being done, rejection free. So of the 68 people that I personally um, recruited, I've had only five conversations. Everybody else just signed up on autopilot because I've spent the last two and a half years building this no like and trust factor, providing value, providing value, providing value, providing great tools, tips, and information for free. So people already know me and they trust me. So they're signing up on autopilot and the five people I've had conversations with had already made a decision before they booked a call with me that they were interested in what I had to offer. They just needed a few more details. And all five of those people said yes and signed up. Wouldn't you like to do that too? And this is when you're working with your brain and doing truly rejection free recruiting. Now, will 100% of people sign up with you? No. However, the worst case scenario is you're going to have an absolutely lovely conversation with a fellow human being who already knows you, already likes you, and already trusts you. And maybe 
for whatever reason, the opportunity just is not right for them. And to believe it or not, when you're in this situation, the biggest decision is really not whether or not they want to work with you, but whether or not you want to work with them. And guys, when you start doing this, it changes everything because now you're working with your brain, with the chemistry in your body, with your body's natural physiological, neurological, biological functioning. And it is an absolute game changer. Now, I mentioned to you um, my Discover the Untapped Power of LinkedIn to Build Your Business and Grow Your Downline. That's at GloriaMcDonald.com slash discover L-I, and that will tell you all, all about LinkedIn and how powerful LinkedIn is. And I have to share with you, I wasn't going to, but I absolutely have to share with you that I really believe there's a two-step process. There's LinkedIn, which is crazy, insanely powerful. And now there's another tool that together in combination with LinkedIn, I know because I'm already seeing it, is blowing the doors off of what you can do with your network marketing business. So what I really, really, really recommend you do is go to GloriaMcDonald.com slash webinar. I wasn't going to share that today, but I just feel like I have to because this, these two things in combination are a game changer. So go to GloriaMcDonald.com slash webinar first, check that out. And if that sounds like something you're interested in, then you and I are going to connect and you'll get all the LinkedIn stuff as a bonus with that. So my first recommendation is go to GloriaMcDonald.com slash webinar, and then we'll chat about all the LinkedIn stuff and the power, uh, the absolute powerhouse combination of these two things. So guys, get out there. Whatever you do, start recruiting rejection free and start sharing this. Share this live with your team members so that they also can start recruiting rejection free because you have to start working with your brain rather than against your brain if you ever want to make this work and if you ever want to be truly successful in the network marketing industry, which I know you can be. Thanks so much for being here. Don't forget to go check out GloriaMcDonald.com webinar, and I will see you soon. Take care.